Okay, let's look at how to do the word Megan in Descript. Now, um, there's one, one letter we haven't worked with yet. This is the G. The G is a curl. So it can curl in any direction you see fit when you're building off or on or into the word line or off of another character like an E. It can connect in any way you like as long as it's clearly a curl. Okay? That makes, that makes it a little bit difficult when you do the S. You have to make sure your S never curls in too much, otherwise it will look like a G. This is, or sh I shouldn't call that difficult, it's just a matter of paying attention when you do it. So S, G. Now, the, the G can also turn into diff different directions that the S can never do, so it's very easy to keep it separate. You can also add a letter inside of the G. So, first of all, let's draw the word H as an example. A, G, and then you can put the E inside. Now remember, you can also turn the curve of the G. So if you flip it, it actually fits into the A, and you get this. H. So as you can see, the G is a very interesting letter. It allows for a lot of flexibility and angle, angles and twists and contorting. Um, other than that, there's not really any new combinations here, so let's quickly look at some simple ways to put these together. M, E, G, A. N. Okay. Now let's uh, make the, the bottom half look a little better. M E G A N. Okay. Now let's try to make a nice little square of this so it looks like a Chinese character. M E G A N. And uh, of course, I'm doing this with a little bit of haste you can make it look very beautiful, especially with a Chinese calligraphy brush. Descript looks awesome with a Chinese calligraphy brush.